Did you know that a silent threat could soon make common infections untreatable? But what if the solution is already in our hands? Antimicrobial resistance, or AMR, is a serious threat to everyone's health. It is a natural process where bacteria, fungi, parasites, and viruses evolve to become resistant to medicines, making infections harder or impossible to treat. Every year, AMR directly claims the lives of about 1.27 million people around the world, one million of them children under the age of five, with sub-Saharan Africa bearing a particularly heavy burden. AMR happens when antibiotics are used indiscriminately, incorrectly, or the treatment is too short or too weak. The more we expose microbes to antibiotics, the more opportunities we create for AMR to develop. And it's getting worse. According to estimates from the World Bank, by 2030, uncontrolled AMR could cost the world up to 3.4 trillion US dollars in economic productivity every year. But what if we could prevent people from getting sick to begin with? What if they were provided with tools for their bodies to fight off diseases? This is where vaccines come in. Vaccines protect people and communities from infection and reduce their spread, especially when a large portion of the population is immunized, thereby reducing the risk of being infected and the spread of the disease, limiting the opportunity for AMR to develop. Vaccines also offer protection from the use of antibiotics to treat secondary bacterial infections and from their inappropriate use for viral illnesses, which may present similar symptoms. This is why health experts, as well as the World Health Organization's Global Action Plan on AMR, recognize immunization as a key tool to combat AMR. But in practice, immunization remains undervalued as a tool to tackle AMR. Just 14 out of the 108 national AMR action plans included immunization programs as part of their tools against AMR. Countries, the international health community, civil society, the private sector and academia must come together to ensure vaccines are integrated in the conception and implementation of national AMR action plans.